labels, coming out, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing drinks, I got shoes, tires, rims, thinking, you know, next day she's being a full-on superstar, you know? Get to wear a tight suit, and nail a lot of tail, you dig? You know what I do in real life? You gotta get me a drink, though, right now, because I'm thirsty, you know? What a troubled man. Sounds like he should lay off the sauce. Also today, a Tourette's theater group banned from the park, unless they take up mine. And finally, in foreign news. Gloss over the implications and hope you enjoy some sporting activity tonight. The State Department is advising against foreign travel. This was Leanne Forge, WCTR News. Let's be careful out there. Deal with your ignorance in one minute flat. Complex issues in 60 seconds. WCTR. It was 9 a.m. The phone rang. Commando pest eradication. You saw a bug on your child's apple? Code red, boys. We got a live one. Your home, much like the rest of the world, is infested with unwanted vermin. Commando pest eradication will wage war on nature, so you don't have to. Hello, ma'am. Thank God you're here. I saw a bug in the kitchen. You did the right thing, ma'am. We'll take it from here. Everything's going to be OK. Commando Pest Eradication uses only the most lethal chemicals to rid your home of unwanted life. Our team is composed of military-trained professionals that know how to take care of a messy situation fast. After successfully defoliating Vietnam, we've turned our attention to the home front. Your home front. We've got the situation in the kitchen contained, sir. But I found this. <laughs> Jesus, what the hell is this? My daughter! Looks more like Viet Cong to me. Commando Pest Eradication. We kill everything in sight so you feel safer. It's the war on nature, and this time we're winning. If you love to hear liberals whine and conservatives lecture, then stay tuned for I Say You Say. The future of America threatened again. This time we mean it. I'm Dr. Phillips. And I'm also Dr. Phillips. Today on the show, do cave paintings in museums make us violent? The anti-beef movement. Both Hitler and Mussolini were vegetarians. And we take on the highly charged debate about test tube babies and actually talk to one. I have flashbacks. I'm going to hysterics in science class. Do you know what it's like growing up in a beaker? That's all today on I Say, You Say. We share last names, but that's about it. I'm Peyton, that's my wife Mary, and this is I Say, You Say, where left is right, and right is wrong. Or where East meets West, and the West always wins. That wall came down, darling. Yes, unfortunately it did. I, I don't know if you saw today's news, so who is in the right in this great dialectical disaster? Is it, as I think, a case of share and share alike, love your fellow man and all wear matching jumpsuits while working on a collective hydroponic farm growing potatoes, or kill or be killed, crush the weak, and starve the poor, as my wonderful wife thinks. You decide, or let us decide for you. Give us a call, and let my wife, a professor in... I'm jacking your sorry ass, punk. I've got a good thing. You just respond badly to me. I, I don't understand it. Are you related to my husband? <laughs> uh, I, I don't think so. I hope not. Have you got a question? can't do his job, you strange, pathetic little sap. Let's have a real caller, please. Hi, my name's Michelle. I'm a first-time caller to the show. I wanted to know what you guys thought about the proposition to ban smoking. Well, this is a simple issue. Smoking. Democracy at work again in our state. Seems like a good thing when you first look at it, but democracy only works when you agree with it. Then it's best to favor a totalitarian state. I'm... Brother Phil, who's been undergoing a hair transplant today. Hey Phil, if you're listening, I hope it's six this time. I won't tell anyone you've got plugs, honey. I'm really proud of you. That's great, honey. But if you want shout-outs, call the rap station. That's offensive. And I'm really offended by what you're saying. I'm a smoker. This used to be a free.
often between stressful stints of genocide and witch burning. And you're so against raising taxes, smokers pay more taxes. 